Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another video. We are back with another episode of Smackdown and I forgot to do that. Um, yeah, just ignore what you saw. We are back with Mr. 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 Charles. Charles. Yeah. Thanks, Charles. You. TW Gaming, he's the only channel of T uh, TW on it, so make sure to subscribe. Yeah, yeah, totally. Anyway, we've got Sept September week three. We are a good six, five, six weeks away from uh, our next pay per view, Vengeance, which is SmackDown weeks. exclusive. How many weeks? Six. six. Okay. Because I've got my go home show next week. Nice. Okay. So let's get right into it. Why not? Why not? In our first pre-show match, in the 74 B minus, in the pre-show bout that had great wrestling and a decent reaction from the crowd, AJ Styles and Alberto Del Rio defeated the Usos in 12:30 when AJ Styles defeated Jimmy Uso by pinfall the Styles Clash. Yeah, that performance from AJ Styles, decent from Alberto Del Rio as well. Yep. Next. In our next pre-show match in a 79B, in the pre-show bout that had good wrestling and decent reaction from the crowd, Dean Ambrose defeated Luke Harper by pinfall with a Dirty Deeds. Dirty Deeds! Dirty Deeds! Next segment. And in our second to final pre-show match, in a 72B-, Randy Orton defeated Aiden English in 8.45 by pinfall with a running punt to the head. The punt is back, lads. And they have great chemistry. Pretty good chemistry. Okay, pretty good. Next segment. C63 in a pre-show battle about decent wrestling, but then Avash Heat and Vermis defeated Mojo Rawley. Enough said. Yep. And we start the show with a 93A. Much better than last week, this opening segment, it <laughs> seems. Yep. That puts over three storylines. And it starts the show hot. Of hot, you know. John Cena was a real start in the segment. Of course he was. Next segment. Uh, we have Daniel Bryan announcing tonight's main event in a B plus 84. And it is Mr. John Cena versus Mr. Bray Wyatt. WrestleMania 30 rematch. Yeah, yeah, right here on SmackDown. You're, you get the best things on SmackDown Live. And then our first match in the 72B minus, in a decent match, Shinsuke Nakamura defeated Derek Bateman in 10 2 with a Samoan driver. Yeah. Is that two losses for Bateman? Yeah, it is. It is. Wow. Mm. You can't even cut a break. Next segment Shinsuke Nakamura cuts a 69C plus promo about how he finally got rid of this leech on his back that is Derek Bateman and he can move on to bigger and better things. Cool. In a 54C minus, not a bad promo from uh, Becky Lynch. She puts over the fact oh, that she'll Gail be facing Kim. Gail Kim next. And that gets a 63C. Not, not a bad female match. Not, Becky not Lynch bad. defeats Gail Kim in 6.37 by pinfall with a pump handle slam. Becky Lynch out wrestling Gail Kim there. Decent match. Let's go. Next, in an uh, B plus 86, uh, Alberto Del Rio is angry. He wants a match against John Cena at, uh, f as soon as possible, he says, but Daniel Bryan doesn't think so. A big name match, a uh, big name rematch like John Cena versus Alberto Del Rio will be saved for the first SmackDown exclusive pay-per-view after the brand split dun, dun, dun. in just six weeks, WWE Vengeance. That's our first match for Vengeance. Um, book, book, yeah. Exciting. Although they have bad chemistry, so it'll yep. probably be like an opener. <laughs> <laughs> uh... No. What? It's ADR. Oh. Not style. I'm living in the past. Uh, you yeah, got to delete the booking. I Sometimes I realise I'm bad at this game, you know. <laughs> like, really bad at this game. 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's our first match booked for Vengeance in six weeks, and our next segment is a B-75 in the back pad. Good wrestling and a decent reaction from the crowd. Kurt Angle defeated Damien Sandow in 640 by pinfall with an angle slam. Slammer. Uh, ne- in the next segment, we s- in a B plus 85, The Miz comes out after Kurt Angle's win, and he announces that in the next edition of SmackDown, next week of course, he will cash in his rematch for the Intercontinental title. Just get that booked in. The two main events as well. Yep, next segment. Cool, cool. Uh, we have... Back to those A stars. Uh, what? Back to those 10 100 yep. A stars. Uh, John Cena finds out about his match at Vengeance against Alberto Dorio, and he promises everyone that he won't disappoint, to, uh, disappoint them like he did against AJ Styles. Next. They be minus 72, and they did some match. Heath Slater defeated Dolph Ziggler in 1405 by pinfall of a smash hit following interference from Kenny Omega for the club helping each other out there, having each other's back. Slater actually getting yeah, a win. Yeah, of course. What, what did you think? Well, he's great in ring, so... <laughs> Next segment. B plus 86, a freestyle segment um, where AJ Styles comes out. He is with his um, club brothers in the ring, standing over the fallen Dolph Ziggler. And he just talks about how Dolph Ziggler was foolish, that he thought he could fight this uh, battle against the club. And yeah. C minus 55. Uh, in an extremely short match, Samoa Joe defeated Zack Ryder in 414 by submission of Coquina Clutch. As planned, this match brought the f- uh, fans back down a little. Hashtag yeah, goodbye, Samoa Ryder Joe, push. Which is more important. Next. <laughs> uh, B plus 86. Dean Ambrose had an interview hyping up his upcoming match against Bray Wyatt. Also hyping up the main event between John Cena and Bray Wyatt, which gets a... 87 B plus. In about. Oh, oh my god. Even though they didn't seem to click. C- Cena does not <laughs> click doesn't. with anyone. In about, about fantastic wrestling and good. Fantastic heat and good wrestling. John Cena defeated Bray Wyatt in 1810 by pinfall with an AA. During the match, we also had Dean Ambrose distract Wyatt. Damn. Ooh. Damn. Next segment gets an 100 A star. Yeah, <laughs> Where Ambrose and week. Cena both celebrate <laughs> in the ring together. And, and the show overall gets a 90 A. Oh, it's 4 3. It's 4 3, lads. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm on my four, way back. 4 3, and, pulling um, it back. Great show. Anyway, if you're enjoying this series, yeah. make sure to leave a like. Please subscribe to me and Charles. And yeah, have a good one.